So this is the new XL wheel that I just put on this bike to replace um, the standard, the stock BMW spoked wheel. I've had two of those fail. The first spoked wheel failed at about 20,000 miles. Um, I replaced it with a brand new BMW wheel. I sent that one up to, to Woody's Wheel Works to have the spokes tensioned before I rode on it. And that wheel failed at about 29,000 29, miles or so with multiple spoke failures. I have both of those wheel spoke failures documented in separate videos that are older than this. Uh, this, uh, since, since I've had multiple failures of the stock BMW spoke wheels, I elected to replace them with a heavier duty wheel, an XL rim, and uh, that was 3,700 miles ago. Yesterday, I had somebody pull alongside me with their window down as I was in a four-lane, I passed them in a four-lane passing area, and apparently they could hear hear a tripping sound or a, a, a sound coming from the rear end, and they looked at the wheel and also saw the wheel wobbling. About two miles later, this person flashed his headlights at me, and it was clear that he wanted to pull me over. So I stopped him, and I stopped, and he and he told me um, what he observed with my wheel, and it was wobbling and making this sound that I, I actually couldn't hear the sound. But after he he said that, I uh, put this wheel on a I put the motorcycle on the center stand and rotated and I, I could see it wobbling a little bit. So I turned around and drove it home. Inspecting it closer, this is what my wheel looks like. It turns out there are seven broken spokes on this wheel. Again, this wheel has 3,750 miles on it and I've been riding on it for a, a, about 10 days less than two months. So about, so about 50 days. Um, if you look closer, it's kind of hard to see how they're bro I'm very familiar with broken spokes on the, the BMW wheels, but on these guys here, if you look down in there, if you look on a normal wheel, like right, a normal spoke, you'll see right there, that's what the spoke head looks like. There's a couple of them. On the broken spokes, if you look in, look in where I'm trying to point now, you can see see that head is missing there's just a void there uh, there are one yeah here's a better view of here's a better view of one of those missing spokes and if you look carefully you can see down in there you can see where the head was sheared off there are two on the right hand side here and on the inside I don't know how well this will show up in the video but if you look look in there you can see this, I'm, I'm gonna point down in there, look at that spoke down in there, you can see that the head is missing on that one as well. It's hard to see this, the missing, or the broken spoke heads on the, on the inside, but on the outside you can see them here. Pretty, pretty well right there. And very sorry about the photography here. I will take a better picture of this wheel once I get it off, once I get it off the bike. Uh, but before I do that, I want to uh, start this bike up and roll the wheel so you can see just what it looks like.
video now and uh, take the wheel off of the bike.